So in this video, you'll learn how to back up your Samsung Galaxy S25 to a USB storage device. So for this video, I'll be using a hard disk, but if you have any other storage device, such as an SSD or a USB flash drive, they can still be used. So the first step when it comes to backing up is to connect your USB device to your phone. If you're using a newer model of your USB storage device, such as a flash drive or SSD, you'll notice that you'll be able to plug it in directly because it will most likely be a type C. But since I'm using the older model, I'll also need to use a OTG connector so that I can insert the flash drive into the connector and the connector into my phone. So it just depends on what kind of USB storage device you're using. But once you've connected your USB storage device to your phone like that, then the next step is to wait for that storage device to be read by your device. So just wait patiently. And you can always choose to confirm by checking in the notifications. You should see the option USB storage added, which means that your phone has successfully detected that you have added a USB storage device. So once you've done all of that, you then want to navigate to settings. And under settings, you want to scroll and select the option app accounts and backup. Under Accounts and Backup, select External Storage Transfer. And then you want to select the option USB Storage underneath the section Backup 2. From here, wait for it to detect if there's any data that needs to be backed up. And then once you've done that, you can choose what type of data you want to back up. You can choose to back up everything. You can choose to back up only calls, contacts, and messages. Or you can tap on Custom and choose exactly what it is that you want backed up. And then once you've selected your preferred option and you've finished customizing what exactly it is you want backed up, if you've chosen custom, just tap on next. And then you'll be asked to confirm that you wish to back up using your Samsung account, as well as having the data encrypted. Just tap on okay and wait patiently for the backup to complete itself. As you're waiting, you can choose to enable keep screen on so that your screen won't turn off during the backup process, allowing you to keep track of it easily. If you want to stop the backup, you can just tap on stop and the backup will be stopped on your phone. So just wait patiently for the backup to complete itself. And then once you're it's done, you will then need to unmount the USB device. Now you'll notice that whenever you connect your USB device to a computer, you should see an encrypted device filled with your Galaxy S25 backup data. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.